Next round of takeoffs. Match 59 will start with the drivers behind the lines. Three, two, one, go. Looks like the Quinfecta might be a thing for the Red Alliance. Yes, indeed. They got, are they going to get credit for seven there? And, uh, Popcorn Popper's a little bit late on that. 30 to 10, the lead for the Red Alliance. Gus just missed that shot. Got a little bit nudged by their Alliance partner, 176, aces high. And there they go. 86 so far. Coming around, looks like they're trying to do some defense on the Blue Alliance practice of doing that. 195's having a tough time with their symmetrical end takes. They're still working that out. It's an exotic design. It's it's kind of cool. I mean, if that ends up working out for them, that's going to be a game changer. Five more needed for the Red Alliance to get the cargo bonus. So a lot of action back there. 176, not finding enough cargo on their side of the field. Eventually, the blue side of the field. They make two more. So the Red Alliance just needs one more cargo being scored. And anybody can do that. Any goal will do. There they go. Looks like we might have that. Gus, 228, adding on to it. Cyber Knights, 195, decided to practice their defense. They've got to watch that. Got to be careful with being too aggressive on defense. One thing to nudge, you get up over the frame perimeter of a robot, and then you could be in trouble. And now we've got trouble. we got some entanglement over there. 176 is stuck on their alliance partner. That's going to be a tough one. Did they just stay there? I mean, they've got that cargo bonus going for them. What are they going to do? How can they release them? That is tough. Maybe they could climb but while they're hanging on to them. Not a good idea. There goes Gus. They're going to take care of that traversal bar like they've been doing so well with 22 seconds left. And that's going to keep them from getting that fourth ranking point. Not that they necessarily need it, but it would have been definitely nice to have. And banging against the glasses, Gus 228 with 10 seconds left. Necatronic Maniacs from West Springfield up on the traversal bar. Cyber Knights look like they've made it to the middle bar and inconceivable trying to get a little bit climbed up there. So Alpha Centauri, their alliance partner. Together in tethered bliss. Let's see the results of that match. That was won by the Red Alliance. And the final score of that match is 54 to 75. Uh, penalties. Red had uh, 12 penalties there. Ordered to the Blue Alliance. Three ranking points. Didn't get the fourth one. Major championship.